Hi everyone, how are you? Good morning to you all. Well, as all of you know, I use a lot of rainwater to water my plants. Because this rainwater has no pesticides, no nothing. It's all very organic. Well, we've had a drought, sort of, kind of this. We have not had any rain, and here's my rain barrel. No water down to the very bottom. So I've had to improvise a little bit here. So you see me watering with mm, good old city water. But all of a sudden, it rained, and which was my surprise when I went to the rain barrel that was on the other side of the house. And I couldn't figure this out, which was my biggest, biggest surprise. But I looked into the barrel when I tried to get some water, and lo and behold, look what I found. I went to get some water from my rain barrel, and I looked really closely because I saw something moving, and I thought, could those be tadpoles? Yes, they were. They're tadpoles in my rainwater. Now I've got to figure out how to get these tadpoles out and have them survive because I do need frogs. Definitely need frogs. I want to um, look, well, on YouTube, find out how I can get these frogs to survive. But that'll be another video coming up soon. Frogs eat little bugs like this one right here on this yellow flower. And this gives me zucchinis, and I love zucchinis, so I need to protect all my plants. So frogs are so important to me. I need a water source, so somehow I need to get me a water source. I don't have that like I did in my other house where I had 24 acres and I had a pond. And here, I have to create it. I know this is the first year of my permaculture. I know it's gonna be probably not completely the way I want it, but it's live and learn. And the permaculture method, of course, is putting everything together. You have herbs and you have vegetables and you have fruit, all completely together. You see here in this video, I have my comfrey, I've got the corn, I got the squash, I've got the zucchini. I've got the cucumber. Everything is together here. Everything grows cohesively. Everything grows. Everything helps each other. I have companion plants everywhere. It's raining right now. It's just gorgeous. Look how nice and green this is. I also have my fruit trees all scattered all over the place. 35, 36, 36, I, I've lost count how many fruit trees I have. I have three or four kinds of apples, peaches, pears, nectarines, um, pawpaws. I have figs, Pe oh, I said peaches. I've got currants, boysenberry, blackberry, raspberry, I have a Flowers, look at this gorgeous flower. Oh, marigolds scattered all over the place. Flowers are very important for your permaculture. They attract all the bees. I have peas, peas growing everywhere, scattered. Oh, I have rows of Sharon right here. Oh goodness, it's gorgeous. Look at my blueberries, some of them already gave me a lot of blueberries, it's secondary blueberries, some peaches, I still have some peaches on my trees, they're gorgeous, they're coming in really strong. Oh my goodness, look at this, I have got all my um, figs, these are my potatoes, anyway, oh, and my tomatoes, well, you get it. Well, goodbye for now, I am ending this video with a picture of the site of my future home, I'm going to build a pole barn to live in. And the picture that you will see is the entryway to it. For now, I will see you in the next video coming up pretty soon. Follow up to my tadpoles. Bye.